Hello there, one more time now. This here is Amos Alligator coming at you from the bayou for another fantastic story. This time it's a Sesame Street Circus of Opposites by Emily Kingsley. And with a little help from my human assistant, let's go. Can't wait now, this will be a lot of fun. It was time for the circus to begin. Welcome, 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 ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, cried Guy Smiley, the ringmaster. Welcome to the most wonderful show on earth, the Sesame Street Circus of Opposites. Guy Smiley blew his whistle. And here comes the circus parade, he shouted. Look, it's Big Bird riding the big elephant. And here comes Little Bird riding on a little elephant. Ha, huh, they're opposite now. Let me direct your attention to the one and only Prairie Dawn, announced Guy Smiley. She's the daring young girl on the sliding wire. There she is, way up in the air. Prairie slid down the wire and jumped to the ground. Now Prairie Dawn is safely down on the ground. Let's hear it for Prairie. Yay, cheered the audience. Ha! And now everyone said, Guy Smiley, watch carefully as Fearless Grover is shot from a cannon. I think he is ready. Yes, Fearless Grover is now in the cannon. Boom. Look at him go, shouted Guy Smiley. Fearless Grover is out of the cannon. Aye, cried Grover. That's exciting now. Grover flew through the air. Ah, he said to himself, this is so much fun. I am flying through the air in my beautiful, shiny, clean, silver and white flying suit. Uh-oh, I think I'm going to land now. Yog! shouted Grover as he fell into a big, deep pile of sawdust. Oh no, he cried. Now my beautiful silver and white flying suit is all dirty. <laughs> Next came the parade of clowns. Dina was a very tall clown. Elma was a very short clown. Telly Monster was a very fat clown. Pearl was a very thin clown. All four clowns now. Now boys and girls called Guy Smiley, watch one of the most fantastic acts in the circus. The incredible hairy monster is now dry. But see what happens when he dies from the platform into the pail of water. He did it, shouted Guy Smiley. He dived right into the pail of water, and now here he is all wet. Huh. Ladies and gentlemen, Guy Smiley announced, in the center ring, our brave trick riders will now perform amazing feats. Just look at Ernie. He is standing on the horse. Oh no, Bert seems to be off his horse. Ha! Huh. They were on, then off. Betty Lou and Cookie Monster were watching the circus from the stands. Hey, Betty Lou, said Cookie Monster, that sure is a full box of popcorn. Would you like some popcorn, Cookie? asked Betty Lou. Wow, said Betty Lou when she saw her empty box of popcorn. It was full, now it's empty. And now the terrific tumblers, cried Guy Smiley. Observe this amazing demonstration of balance and skill featuring our own Rodeo Rosie on the bottom and the fabulous Granny Fanny Nestle Road on the top. Now the Sesame Street Circus of Opposites presents a courageous count on the high wire, cried Guy Smiley. And on the low wire is the fantastic Fatatita. Finally, the last act of the circus. A small car drove into the center ring. The door opened. The clowns came piling out of the car. First clown to climb out of the car was Frazzle. The last clown to climb out of the was Barkley the dog. Ha, Barkley's a clown now. It's sad when the circus is all over, said Cookie Monster. And he and Betty Lou walked home together. I had a great time, said Betty Lou. I sure am glad we went to the circus. So it was sad and it was glad. The opposites now. Oh, what a fantastic book. The Sesame Street Circus of Opposites. I had a fantastic time. I had a fun time reading it to y'all now. This here is Amos Alligator coming at you from the bayou saying subscribe and like for more of these fantastic stories. And I will see you later. Ha <laughs> ha.